What's good, you too? It's your boys, your men, your fellas, your fathers. We're not fathers. Yeah. But um Y'all dead be dads of YouTube though. Hmm. Table slapping funny. TSF for sure if you don't feel like saying all that. And today, you know what we got today? I do know what we got. You know what we got? I know what we got. You know what we got? I take a guess. Go ahead and guess. <clears throat> all right, uh, today I think we're reacting to some K-pop. Mm. Yeah. Um, what is the song called? Uh, Chick Chick Boom mm. by Stray Kids. Yeah. yeah. Nah. So like Stray Kids like, like homeless? I don't know. Uh, There's a lot of them too. I think there's eight of them. That's, that's, yeah. that's about like regular, yeah. what you think? Yeah, we gotta, like people be homeless together. Yeah. I, I would hope it's not more than B12. Shout out to B12. Shout out to B12. <laughs> <laughs> no, but the funny part is you might not remember this. Well, I might have, you might remember now because I talked about it earlier, but I think me and you, we did a video with Sierra forever ago. We listened to a song by them. I don't remember the name of the song. So it's not. Oh, it was by them? Yeah. I remember us doing a song about you. Yeah, it was the same, it was the same group. So uh, this is gonna be our first personal K-pop reaction on the channel, I believe. So let's say. K-pop is Korean pop, correct? Exactly. Yes. Uh, okay. And if we're wrong on that, let us know. And uh, be nice to us too, because you know, it's our first one. And I know y'all community, y'all really love these people. So this is gonna be our first time listening to this group as a unit. We're gonna be honest about it. But I'm expecting it to be good though, because I don't know what the hell is going on. I don't know if this song will be in a new Deadpool movie or what, but we literally can see Wolverine from behind. Oh, that's that's yeah. actually you, Jack? That's actually you. Yeah, I just see, I just see back. I scrolled over the preview earlier when I was like, we should react to it, and I'm like, what, what's going on? Why are they in this? So I don't know. We know that the song is going to be <coughs> in Korean. We're aware of that, and then also that I know a lot of these songs they use English words too. You know what I'm saying? I know BTS does that as well. Not to compare them. I don't know if y'all beefing. I don't know if the Stray Kid fans don't like BTS or whatever. <laughs> you never know. You never know. It might be a war. I like the shirt. Oh, thank you. You know what I'm saying? Let me have it. No. So, y'all ready to get started? Yeah. All right, cool. So, this is Chick Chick Boom by Stray Kids. Let's get, let's get it. Want your shirt. It's recommended to stay home. Why didn't you mention this? What the hell's going on? I can't wait for this moment. Next week. So, um. I was in there for 30 minutes. What? No, no. No. No, no. The one thing. A toilet? Yes. A sick note. <laughs> toilet paper. Good evening. And thank you for watching CCD News. Uh, I'm Ryan Williams. And we have great news. Cut with the purple hair. I don't know what he said, but he was on there. <laughs> <laughs> they got like English captions on there. Oh, they do. Oh, I should have put them on. All the time. Yeah, I thought we just had the vibe. <laughs> <laughs> Messing up already. Now, okay, now I got, I'm gonna say this because it's like, and it don't have to because music don't have to rhyme. Mm -hmm. But like, would is it going to rhyme in their language but not rhyme in English? Bro, sometimes I see artists do this kind of stuff and it's like it'll rhyme in both. I don't know how they do that though. I've seen that happen. Mm -hmm. So it'd be crazy if we see the English words they rhyme and then when we hear it, it's rhyming too. I don't know. We might just have to listen for it and just look at it. Y'all look like anime characters. <laughs> That's a compliment. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> very, very pretty features. <laughs> no diddy. Oh, 
no tea. The, the, the tongue roll on that motherfucker. <laughs> That's that Johnny Pay. <laughs> Obviously, cause like, let me see, what, what, what's what's the, what, what the views on the bit uh, at the moment? Uh, thirteen million views was uploaded nineteen hours ago. Yeah, thirteen million views. So obviously, they got some, uh, you know, they got a good following, but they got some motion. If they about to be in the Deadpool Wolverine movie. Uh, oh, I don't know if the song. Like, can somebody in the comments explain the context of? It has to be in a movie. If they're, if they're where they have both. Uh, I can see Deadpool being like a K-pop fan. You're right. Yeah, yeah. I don't think that's very in character. Right. Yeah. Interesting. I didn't even know the context of that. So I guess if we hear a straight kid song in a movie, then that'll make even more yeah. sense. I don't know if it's gonna be that song or if maybe Brian Riddle's just a fan of him. I don't know. Man, that's, that's, I guarantee that's probably gonna be. It. <laughs> it just makes sense. Cause yeah. why? <laughs> yeah. I have both you, Jackson and Jack. Jersey. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Drink your water. <laughs> They had both of them, both Wolverine and Deadpool in there. Yeah. How about that? Yeah. That's cool as hell, though. I like it, though. Who they choreographer? Do they come up with the dances themselves? I feel, like, I feel like they, they come up with that. There's so many of them, like yes. somebody else. That's right. That's right. Yeah, you're right. It's probably one, one person that's the choreographer, mm-hmm. or like a couple of them, or whatever. I always just find that really interesting how, like, the stuff that we kind of grew up with, with like RB and pop groups coming up. It kind of fell out and don't exist no more, but it's still the culture of that is still yeah. like on that end. Like we grew up with boy bands and girl groups and R and B groups, but yeah, that don't, that's not really a thing no more. Like, is there really a? And it's still popping over there. Yeah, it's like the thing over there. It's like the it's the group group culture. And they have a lot of K-pop groups. Right? That's what I'm saying. It feels that way. I could be wrong. I think there's some that's like Titans, and but there's still a bunch like. I feel like every other day. Teen Titans? Who's, okay, all right. <laughs> Who's that, that one group? Some of our teams, though. There's that one group that does music with, um, that did some songs with, um, or collapse with Megan Thee Stallion. That's, 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 that's BTS. Yeah. That's BTS? Yeah. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's K-pop. Yeah. Never knew that. Yeah. I like them. Yeah, they're cool. Smooth like butter, like brimming. I'm not gonna, I, I can't swear. I'm not gonna. <laughs> but yeah, I like the song. I like the video, too. <laughs> Me, too. Who was Buddy that was singing that sound of uh, Angelic? <laughs> yeah. I ain't gonna lie, even though we had the English chapters up, I was, I was. <laughs> <laughs> we were just fine. <laughs> I'm, I'm just watching the music. 
Yeah, enjoy, yeah. enjoy the song. Hey, so y'all thinking we got some deeper meaning and it's something that's some political messages or something? Absolutely. We didn't get none of that shit. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not here to say that. That was a fucking bar. And I'm, I'm here. Because <laughs> <laughs> I, I know somebody in the comments gonna be like, "But did y'all get that rap first? Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> we did. I we really just enjoyed the, the song. Bro. We just here for the vibe. <laughs> Maybe as we do more of this, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna be on it. I just find that so cool uh, because they big over here too. That they uh, I had burnt. So uh, I didn't work with them. Uh, but uh, yeah, yeah, like that. It's a part of American culture too. Like they use English words and stuff. I know English is used a lot of places too. But shit, <clears throat> shout out to the straight kids. I ain't really got nothing bad to say. I wish I, uh, I wish I knew Korean. I probably could, <laughs> I probably could enjoy it more. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It was a good watch. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. You got anything up? I don't know what I'm saying. Shout out to straight kids. They yeah. did their thing. How old you think they are? Like, you think they like between like 16 and 19? I or you think they like, older than that? I feel they're older than I feel like they're probably between like 20 and 25. How Buddy was singing, he, he didn't experience life. You don't get vocals like that <laughs> if you ain't been through no shit. Or, Michael nigga. Jackson was singing like that when he was like nine. But he was getting beat on though. That's a lot. That's the only about to say. It is. <laughs> it is. It is though. That nigga is not good. <laughs> but he went been through some shit. You know they say good music comes from the struggle. Think about all the great black music. Them niggas went through some shit. Yeah. yeah. That's what I'm saying. Not all of them. Not all of them. I'm saying, like, but you know. Chris Brown started going to Jeff D. Got famous. Oh, that's that. He did that shit himself. I'm just saying, a lot of them niggas went through stuff. Shit. A lot of the rappers would be like, shit, I came from nothing. The niggas really came from nothing. Yeah. That shit crazy. So, uh, damn, how we get on this topic? <laughs> <laughs> we got all off topic. You talking about people getting beat on? I'm just saying. And, and, and for, that, for the vocals, I feel like the vocals, there's some soul. You know, soul come from something. Yeah. So we got so much up. I ain't get beat. I'm not. It ain't gotta get beat. It's just it's other. It can be. It can be other stuff. I'm off the beat. Well, I don't know. Sound like he. Sound like he mad. I'm not mad. I'm not upset. I promise you. But I will be upset if y'all don't hit the like button. All right, because it's gonna help with the engagement. Help people find the channel. Stuff like that. And also comment. Uh, y'all can comment more suggestions of songs. K-pop songs, straight kids songs. Like I said, I don't know if the niggas beefing. I don't know what the dynamic is group to group, so I don't know if it's strictly straight kids. Do they have actual K-pop beef? That's what I'm saying. Like how they I have think, rap beef? I, th- I think I don't think he meant like beef, but like you know how like the fans be like, oh my, my yeah, group is better than your group. That's what I mean. Like it could. It's always gonna be fans like that. I think they better than the next people. Right. I'm, I'm right. not comparing. I'm not trying to compare. But what if like you this, are? I feel like this genre of music. I'm sorry. Like, yeah. This, yeah, yeah. I feel, like, I, feel like, <laughs> I, feel like, I feel like this genre of music doesn't like. It's so fun. Like how, like, how could there be like? You know, but people find a way. I guess they just be serious about their dance moves, guys. Oh, they stole that from them. Like, what if it's shit like that? So and so did it better. It's just like. Okay. Yeah, we didn't know this. Billy Ocean invented the moonwalk. <laughs> he really did. <laughs> Michael Jackson perfected it. All right. We didn't worry about that. But anyway. <laughs> you want to know why? No, all right. All right. All right. All right. All right. It makes a full circle. I mean, he had to get the moves right. Otherwise. <laughs> now, he was wrong by then, huh? When he did the moonwalk. You tell me. You think he just picked that up when he got older? The moonwalk? Yeah. You thought he would be. Th- you think that's something he just Shit. had tucked away for like years? You seen that video where he was in the, he was basically moonwalking on stage when he was a kid. You know, you know what else does a moonwalk? Bobby Brown. You know what he been doing? We it's I, 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 it okay. makes sense. What I'm, I'm cooking. I'm saying, bro. That's what happened. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, I just wanted to tell y'all to subscribe. I'm so sorry y'all still here. We really all the right now. Oh my goodness. We just scared all the kids fans away. I just promise you right I just promise you right there. No, that's what he said happened. He said it was like in the, in the fried chicken. That was his first. Are you serious? He put coke in the chicken? That's so fucking funny. So he had coke and chicken, but it wasn't a soda. 
Yeah. <laughs> so that was his first experience with it. Oh. I didn't think that was true. Yeah. Okay, y'all just subscribe to the channel. We trying to grow. Oh, hold on. Before you know how, you know how niggerish that is. What you mean? To put like cocaine and fried chicken? Was it like in the batter? Like yeah, like, like you fried it. Yeah, like they. Fried. I don't know if it like they just used straight down. They might have like mixed it in. I'm pretty sure they mixed things. If you just did it, that bit would have been. That bit was fine. I don't know what cocaine smell like. I don't. I couldn't tell you. I don't think good. Cause then it would be cause cause when you burn it, don't it, it's right, crack. Yeah. So so yeah, crack chicken. What is it like? <laughs> that, that chicken from um, that clone town. All right. We all subscribe. Click <laughs> the notification bell so you get notified every time we upload. Y'all probably, oh my god, oh my goodness, this is crazy. This is, this is table seven forty signing out. God damn. <laughs>